You are the mighty God, the great I am. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are the mighty God, the great I am. Alleluia, Alleluia. You are the mighty God. Look to your eyes, worship Him. Oh, Alleluia. Hallelujah. You are the mind. We need before you, we worship you. We exalt your holy name, O oh God, our Father. Oh, 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 oh. You are the mighty God. For thy words I am. worship you father for the grace of this mountain of prayer the restoration prayer garden city lord help us to go deeper and deeper and deeper in life do not allow us to remain at a particular stage when you expected us to have moved to the next level holy most holy is the Lord God? Is the Lord God? Is the Lord God? Holy, most holy, is the Lord. The more you worship God in truth, the more He recharges you. God is recharging our battery because He wants our lights to shine. Worship Him with me. Worship Him with me. He is Almighty. He is almighty. He is God. He is not a man. Holy most holy He is the Lord of God. He is the Lord of God. He is the Lord of God. Yes, Lord. Holy, most holy, is the God of God. He is the God of God. Most high. Thank you, 
Jesus. Lord, you are holy. And we worship you in the beauty of your holiness. We know that you are our God. Through this prayer and fasting, Papa, recharge us that this year, 2019, we all will move higher. Yeah. Through Christ our Lord. Yeah. Give God a clap offering as you see now. How many of you believe that you move higher this year? How many of you believe that you move higher this year? If you believe, say, I believe. I believe. Say, I am, I am moving higher. This year. This year. I, am I am moving higher. This year. This year. I, I. My family. My family. We, are we are moving higher. This year. This year. God will do it. He is able. He does sing that song to him. You know God is here looking at you looking at me he is able abundantly able to deliver and to save my God is I know you can do it for me, Papa. To deliver those who trust in Him. Trust in Him. He is able. Abundantly able. To deliver and to save. by 12 o'clock we have another mass we share the word of God again by 3 by 12 we say the angelus the mass then by 3 divine mercy then the mass and we are okay to go now hear this now I want to give you a classical teaching there are many things we must know so that we don't lose life how many stages of life do we have you say you are moving higher this year abby you are moving higher now how many stages of life do we have so where do you want to move higher to <laughs> move higher to where now you know the worst spirit that can destroy a man is it's horrible. Ignorance. Moving higher to where? Please ask your neighbor. Moving higher to where? How many stages do we have? You don't know. Eh? Today. How? Let me hear your own. Lecturer. Abraka University. Ega Dan Kenavia. Stage one. Stage two. Stage three. That is biology you are talking. Oh. Uh, uh, tell your neighbor we have five stages. Again, how many stages of what? Five stages of life. If you want to move higher, the fifth stage is where I am praying for. When you enter the fifth stage, Emmanuel Balasigo, you are you begin to cruise. You cannot go far. 
the plane continues to go up until it gets to a point where it will balance. If you don't get to that level, you cannot balance. Are you listening to me? There are five stages that you and I we are destined to pass through. And it is only when we get to the five, the fifth stage that you can begin to cruise. Cruising means you can begin to move. But if you have not reached that stage, no. Stage one is called free stage. Free stage. It is a stage where <laughs> Like this small girl now. She's in a free stage. A free stage. You are just free. You can play. You can do anything. You can jump up and down. You don't have the mind of your own. You don't have the mind of your own. Are you getting my point? This, when you were two years, three years, your parents were just telling you, you are free. You are eating free food. Free house. That is a stage. Everybody enjoy that free stage. And it becomes an error if as you are growing old, you are still at that stage. So if you know you are here, you have a son that is 40 years, 50 years, and your son is still at the level of free stage, then there is something wrong. Free stage is that stage where you wear clothes, you don't know how you get the cloth. You wear shoes, you don't know how you got the shoe. You eat food. You don't know how you got the food. Everybody enjoyed that stage. In the spiritual realm, it is a stage where grace is just on you anyhow. Free stage. Free. Let me tell you. I don't know how I pass from Otakara 1 to Otakara 2. Nobody here can tell me how they pass. But they just push you. They go. Did they go? It is called free stage. It's a stage of life that you cannot, you are not even being blamed for anything. You are not even being rebuked for anything. But you just come just like that, free. But you are not permitted to remain there. I say you are not permitted to remain there. Ah, you are not permitted to remain there. If there's anybody here that is still at that free stage free stage of life. May God deliver you in Jesus name. Did I hear you shout in loud amen? I refuse to be at that. For instance, you are in the seminary. You are in the seminary. You don't know how the money they come. That house is just they train you. You don't for seminary. You don't work out they go. That is free stage. Free stage. Everything your mama, everything your papa for how long will you remain there? For how long? So we'll talk about that. I am moving higher. Aha. Somebody must leave that stage. To the second stage. And the second stage is called the struggling stage. Struggling stage. This stage is where, oh, you just realize that, ah, uh -uh. no, 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 no. That is why you see many young girls, they will leave their village. Many young boys, they will leave their village. They just want to, um, ba, 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 ba. I can't remain in my mother's house. No, no, can't you mambo? Can't you hustle? Can't you job? Let me go for a job. Let me go and do it. Let me go and learn trading. It is called struggling stage. And you know what? It is an error. If at your age, Baba, you are still at that stage. Why should you be struggling at this age? You now, you are not supposed to be at the struggling stage. You are, that is the stage of labor. It is a stage of labor. That is, you just discover that, ah, ah, why should it be that, ah, ah, mama ne ye muni, mama, no, 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 at my age, I can feed myself. You see where young girls will just carry their bag and say, mommy, I'm going to Lagos. That is the stage of an amateur. The stage of an amateur. This is called struggling stage. That is the stage of all those people you see at Umunede Junction. Karen Banana, Karen Tejerin, Karen Odara, and any motor that holds brake, they rush. 
Will you remain there forever? Eh? So you can see that that boy, that girl, that the mother and the father that they were feeding, feeding, has gradually realized that I need to make my own money. It is called struggling stage. It's good, it's good. But you are not permitted to remain there. It is very good, but you are not permitted to remain there. So if there's anybody in your family that has been caged to remain in that stage, if you can stand up and shout, Amen, that you will be broken now. That you will be broken now. That you will be broken now. See that. There are some people, their husband are still in that stage. Imagine your husband we don't reach 54 years. You see, they for struggling. Now, can I ask you, are you understanding me? Are you getting my point? Are you getting the point? So, that stage mm -mm, is not good. That struggling stage is the struggling stage of a graduate. Because when the graduate was in the school, the parents were paying his school fees. He now graduates and wants to make a living and becomes difficult for that boy to make a living. He begins to struggle. If time is not taken, you will be programmed to be suffering till you die. I refuse to struggle until I die. Child of God, you will not struggle until you die. Receive it. You will not struggle until you die. You will not struggle till you die. You will not struggle till you die. In the name of Jesus. I refuse to struggle. But unfortunately, I have seen men of 40 years still on free stage. I have seen them. Their mama said they feed them. Their papa said they feed them. They never buy, they know, they know they feed buy clothes. Now their mama said they buy clothes for them at the age of 40 something. I don't lie. I don't see them. The worst of it that some of them are even in UK and abroad. If their mama don't send money, go. Free stage at the age of 42, you are still waiting for pocket money from your mother. When your mates at the age of 28, 29 are already giving their mother reward for training them, I don't care whether your mother is rich or not, even though your mother is rich or not. These are those. Do you know that there are some people at the age of 40, they still wait for their parents to buy them a car. Mom, my car is old. Can you change it for me? Huh? For how long? When your maids at the age of 42, they are buying vehicles for their mommy, both male and female. You see why I say we must move higher. Prayer. 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 If I tell you that even as I am as a priest, I am desiring a level which which I will tell you. That level. <laughs> now level will make you yourself eh, see me as God. And that is the fifth level. So if you know you are here, you can perceive that your children as a mother is in the first stage, even at this point. You, you begin to wonder, if I die now, how they go survive? If I die now, how they go survive? Because you are still, you are still in charge. You are still in charge. God forbid. How dare you are still in charge? In charge of what? Why should you still be in charge?
So nobody who is supposed to be struggling should be folding hand in stage one. It's an error. You, you use prayer and pray your children out. Use prayer. Don't go, John, 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 John you're supposed to be, John, bah, you will spoil things. Use prayer. When you come like this, raise prayer points. I was discussing with one of my sons concerning this atmosphere of Ekalan. You see, in Ekalan, in a calland. We are still close to idol worship. Hi. If not, I mean, there are few of them maybe in our courts. But the Igbo people now, Alosi is no longer in vogue. That is why is there any ministry in Igbo land because they have passed this level that we are in now. In Abo, we still believe in Igbo. We still believe in Igbo Afa. We still go to church, but we still go to Obebulu. A car people are still believing in Obebulu. Obebulu. We are, we are still chopping in a calan. But the yoke will be broken one day. Yeah. I'm telling you, go to Christian homes. Many of you, mamas, all of you here. And I'm telling you now that that is why your children are still struggling. Until you whip her car from that nonsense. Until you have faith in God that no matter the problem, that God is God. We are still backward in the spiritual realm. We are still backward in the spiritual realm. So we have more work to do. Intercessors pray. Not praying for the human beings you are seeing. Pray in the atmosphere that that spirit making the people of God to still go after Obebulu must get out of a calan in Jesus name yeah. the moment they will have been here before eight people will come and visit her in Orogodo here three Agwala you are just somewhere before there is a problem attacking anybody in Orogodo here before you have eight ten visitors check here Madeto Asena Danejen and it is still common may God destroy that spirit may God destroy that spirit with the Holy Ghost stage 3 dream stage dream in law dream stage this is a stage where oh hmm. if i get money i go do this if i do like this i go like, like if it didn't work now if this still open now if this door open now if i that's another stage and this is as a result of somebody who is struggling we begin to think of how to how wish how wish that stage is important though it's a dream stage is a dream of provocation when you are not comfortable with struggling you begin to desire it is a stage of desiring but unfortunately let me tell you some people don't even get to that stage they know they're even hungry you know they hungry them to be better than what they are the moment they are they are struggling and they are able to get peanuts they relax they don't think that hey you are you are you are selling tomato can't you produce thin tomato you are you are you are you are selling parts can't you sell moto so that stage is the stage of dreaming from struggling you begin to dream from struggling you begin to dream that is the third stage of life and you know what a lot of people die in their dream that there many people die if you go for 
for for graveyard. Many people when they there, now that place then died, but they were busy dreaming. Are you understanding me? You can easily understand this if you see your son. I say, Mom, I say, hey, Mom, John, you are suffering too much. You say, Mom, don't worry. I am praying for the door to open. I have this plan now. Mom, don't worry. That is dream. You know that this boy is struggling. You know that your daughter is struggling. And your daughter is telling you, Mom, there is some dreams in me. That means he has passed that level and entered it. Don't worry, Mom. I'm, I, I'm, I, I have this plan. I have this plan. I say, yeah. When will you marry? Uh -uh. When will you marry? Mom, don't worry, you know. I am a man. Mom, don't worry, Mom. Mom, don't worry, Dad. Don't worry, don't worry. Worry. Who can worry? Who can worry? You are not permitted to spend so much time at this stage. Dream stage is not real. It is a passage. When will you marry? Mom, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Mom, don't worry. Mom, I will marry now. Mom, when I marry, you can call Lomba. Don't worry, you can call Lomba. You can call Lomba. Next time, maybe you can call Lomba. And many of our children have kept us at that stage. And you yourself, you have accepted that stage. Even you now, you, you too, you are dreaming. Father Dibia is dreaming. But I am not permitted to remain there. Wave your hand and shout hallelujah. If you know that you are going to pass through that stage, you are moving higher. Shout two, three, hallelujah. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. My son must not remain there. My daughter must not remain there. My children must not remain there. And we move to the next stage the fourth stage and that is called actualization stage somebody say actualization that is you, a lot of people have reached there things are working out the way they want they have planned their dreams have come true they have married they have gotten children they have a business that is the stage of actualization that is the stage of actualization. That is, you have moved from the stage of freedom to the stage of struggling to the stage of dream and it has come true. For instance, I have married now and I have three children. I have a job now. I have a business now. I, I have gotten my visa now. And some people think that that is the final stage. A lot of people died there. A lot of people died there because here they were planning they've seen it come true they've planned it and they've gotten it and for them they have achieved it for them they are successful for them they have made it amen but hear this the fifth stage is the one that the Bible spoke about. The fifth stage. Many have not reached there. Even me, I am struggling to reach there. That is why I am still moving on. And the fifth stage says, according to the Bible, the whole world is waiting for the manifestation that is the stage called stage of manifestation. Manifestation stage. The whole world is waiting for that one. That one is when, when even without rain, your way full with water. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. Even without rain, your way full with water. That is the level God wants you and I to operate on. The stage of manifestation. That is what? Doing what? Manifesting the glory of God. No rain. But hey, you're well full. People begin to say, how manage? With that much, the grace of God is carrying you. That is the level. You are 
enjoy it. You are fulfilling your destiny. Hey, if you know who you are, my daughter, you see the way you are. Come. You don't even know who you are. If you understand what I see in you, eh? Ah, la, la, la. Your, your colleagues are to serve you. I'm not joking. No. That is called manifestation. You will not understand at all how it is happening. Say, man, how did I get to this level? It is the moment when grace, when God carries you at the back. You feel me? Like the ego. Impossibility, Aris, yeah? You, 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 you go just there, eh? Sign check of 300 million. Dash. People go, they say, eh? As we are living now, are you aware that why you and I are struggling to buy Tokumbo car? Somebody can buy 50 Teroba and Dash. You know, go shake up. Lift up your hands. Lord, I also raise your power upon your daughter now. <sighs> get out. 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 That is it. You see, she cannot manifest until this nonsense is out. Get it out. Take it. Fire. Come on. Fire. Get out of her. Get out of her. One, two, go. <sighs> Lose out now. Leave her alone. She cannot. She can never. This is the one that the devil fights. This is the one. This one. You see those. You see those. Stage one. Stage two. Stage three. Stage four. Those ones are physical. The manifestation is the one that the devil covers. If you don't know, as she did, as she, huh? I know that I do. I have my plan. I had this. I had this. Now let's fire upon away every evil fail on you. Fire! Come on! Come on! Burn! That fire must go today. That is the one that the devil fight. The stage called manifestation. Yeah, man, you look normal. You look okay. You look good. You are actualizing your dreams, but you are not manifesting. FAG. Yes, I plan that I will build a house. I don't want more law. can wear hair. He be making wear there. That is actualization. Manifestation, nko. Manifestation, nko. Or see the whole world <laughs> is waiting <laughs> for the manifestation. That is the whole world is waiting for for that uniqueness in you, given by God. But let me tell you, friends. That is the one devil fights. I'm telling you. You may think that you are okay. Because you are at the fourth level. The first one, two, three, and four. They are ordinary level. This last one. TV, is the manifestation. Or see the whole world. How can the whole world be waiting? If you understand who you are. Look at me now. With all the dreams to be giving food to the poor here. I cannot actualize it. I'm not manifesting it. How I wish we have 10 bags of fries said to be sharing every week. Who will do it? But when we come to the stage of manifestation, you will be struggling who we give. Who are those who give for this week? Me, me. You wait. Keep your own next week. <laughs> hey, watch. You, you cannot understand how your business is moving. You cannot understand how your life is going. You cannot understand how money is coming. You will just be saying, what is happening to me? Because there is manifestation. The glory of God, the power of God, the grace of God, the anointing of God is pushing you. It is not your beauty. It is not your phonetics. It is not your English. It is the grace of supernatural power upon you. Oh, we may, you will be, you will be check out, you will be you will be it can never happen until darkness is totally out of your life. You see some people, because they have one gift or the other, one gift or the other, you relax. 
because you are they commend you they praise you here you relax you can never manifest may the lord heal you huh? look at this little girl now look at what she's passing through go 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 The devil fights. Let me tell you, devil is not ready to fight whether you can go to school or make money. No. He will fight your manifestation. Or see the whole world, how can the whole world be waiting for your manifestation and you refuse to manifest? Because there are powers holding you. They keep making you to struggle. In what struggle? Let me tell you. I have so many people who I've come in contact with and I see them struggle to make money. And in my spirit, I try to let them know that that is not a good level. But if you are struggling to make money, you are struggling, then that means you are laboring. You are not under favor. Manifestation takes you to level of favor. Why should you be struggling to keep your marriage? <laughs> eh? Why should you be struggling to keep your marriage? If you know what some people are, are doing to keep their marriage, <clears throat> you will weep. That is, they are struggling to show that they are at the level of struggling. They are struggling to keep their marriage. They are ashamed, are afraid. Well, they, they are struggling. Why should you struggle? When your marriage is supposed to be showing the glory of God. When you're supposed to be manifesting greatness and you are struggling. Mm. 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 Go ahead, man. To keep a marriage. How many women? How many women? Without sweat. How many women? Marriage are sober. So for the marriage to remain. And then even the woman, all home was I say, I don't know. I do what? If your husband is manifesting the glory of God, and you, you are manifesting the glory of God, do you know how the marriage will be like? If your husband is manifesting the glory, you, you are manifesting the glory. Kaka, Ijegbere, you hold your, you hold your hand to go to prayer. There is no struggle, honey. Are you? Going? Let's go. No, no, let's go. Let's go. That is why you see many people who are manifesting the glory of God. They are happy, happy. My ministry, must, uh, I told you yesterday that I have changed gear. Uh, I have changed gear. I am making a lot of mistakes that is eating me up. One happened just yesterday here. A child that I'm training. I suffered to raise 78,000 naira to give to a small boy. Give to a small boy 78,000 to go and pay in school fees in college. Pay your school fees. Pay your acceptance fee. And then pay whatever you are able to pay with this 78 until I get money again. The next day, I saw the young boy. I said, hi, have you paid your school fees? What, what do you think should be my response? What do you think I was expecting to hear? No, tell me what do you think I was, I was expecting to hear? Yes, father, thank you, I've paid. Abby? Good, God bless you. And what did I hear? He told me, I have not paid. And I said, why? With anger. Why? He said, uh, there are some things I'm supposed to pay. I did not tell you. I said, I, 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 paid, uh, I paid that one. And then the money is not enough to pay the school fees. Oh, God. Oh, God of my father. Oh, when you are home here. Jesus. Oh God, Uturabam. Oh. I said, What? What? I just drove my car. I left with anger. 
iwe wem e fe kom ogon me bu mem and I said I suffered one night I raised 68 for one the next morning I raised 78 for one and I said quickly go pay your school fees pay your acceptance fee pay if change remain take even I gave the young boy extra one five to hold in hand mama. all I wanted to hear is sir I have paid my school fees. I have paid all my tuition fees. And say, okay, pray for me. If I have again, I will give. If I want to know that there are some things he's supposed to pay, he didn't tell me. He had to start paying those ones. Okay. I just first come out. I now call the mother. I now told the mother, what is all this? I, 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 I'm dying of BPO. This nonsense i don't like it though i'm giving you an instance why manifestation must come you must do your own part god will do his own part and i said okay yesterday i saw the young boy and the mother if you look at the young boy's face it was all for that the boy is angry so the mother, I tried to explain to father. Father refused to listen. I tried to explain to him. Father refused to listen. Who? The dear Moya. And the mother was comfortable with what this boy was saying. No, I said, okay. Go and pack your load for my house. Go and stay with your mother. And it's when you come and knock at my door for school fees, and I'm able to give you. You will respect. You, you see, you angry with me. A boy that cannot in any way see me on the road and talk to me because I put you in my house. Let me help your family. You are now angry with me that I, I refuse to. Even when I told the boy in the presence of the mother, oh yeah, go and carry your things and go. He didn't even say, please forgive. Sorry. The mother was looking at me more. The boy was looking at me more. He showed that mother and child have this cause. The child has over complained to the mother. Be so ya, hey, hola. And I'm now learning how to do my charity. I told you daddy that I will train people without them living in my compound. So when you decide for school fees, you come. Bok, bok, bok. Can I see father? Father say, Come tomorrow. Come to the office. And I sign, I give you a check. I say, Go. You say thank you and go and meet your mother. Because I cannot be training somebody who is irresponsible and giving me BP. After I have suffered preaching, I want to go and prepare myself for the next message of God. Oh, even Jesus Christ said, Were they not ten that were hid? The other nine, where are they? To come and say, Thank you, Baba. Now it has become a right. You see. My ogre is no longer charity. I said, Oh, yeah. Yesterday night, I called the mother. I said, Mother, for this particular child, my hand not there again. The other one, I did train that one. Now, why have I shared this with you? When your charity begins to poison you, you will not manifest again. When you have workers, cooks, drivers, stewards, secretaries, staff, and their presence is eating up your spirit, be careful. Go back to the drying board because something is covering you from manifesting. The joy of the Lord should be your strength. When you are doing things and you are happy, God is happy, you should do more. You should go far. You should accept more. Am I talking to somebody here? Everybody here, God will help you and I to manifest in Jesus' name. Somebody say, I must manifest. I must manifest. Say, I must manifest. 
God bless you. God knows what he's doing for you. The devil will not cover you. The devil will never cover you. You will manifest. Now, permit me to conclude by telling you that what is it that can stop you and I from manifesting? Give we hear who? What is it that can stop you from manifesting? What is it that can stop you? For years, you are not able to manifest. Yes, you are struggling. Yes, you are in pain. Yes, you are, you are, you are, you are, you are in trouble. God bless you. May you manifest. May you manifest. May you manifest. May you manifest. Whatever that evil veil will disappear, you will manifest. Surely you will. That is the level. That is why you are a Christian. That is why you keep coming for prayer. You will not be tired for prayer. You think that it is actualization? Because you have one car, two cars. That is the level of actualization. You, you, you actualize what? Of course, when you're going to school, you can wear salary. You pass, your star will manifest. This prayer, when you come so, one day it will explode. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. So shall it be. Grace upon grace. Somebody say, Lord, I want to manifest. Jesus, I want to manifest. Take me to that level. Take me to that level. Take me to. I want to manifest. I want to manifest. Without struggling, no Abia. Eh? Do you do you force river to flow? River is manifesting its nature. The nature of a river is to flow. You don't need to pump any river to flow. The moon will shine. You don't need any, gener any generator to make the moon to shine. May your children manifest. Amen. Father Dibia must manifest. Amen. Our ministry must manifest. Amen. Our ministry must manifest. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, do it for them. Do it for them. That is why they are here. Do it for them. Let them manifest. In the name of Jesus. Transfer of blessings. Transfer of grace. Super grace, super grace, you will manifest. You will never labor in vain. Your children will manifest. Your husband will manifest. You will manifest. Somebody say, I will manifest. 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 You will manifest. Come on, shout it out, amen. amen. That is our prayer. You will manifest. Home, we will manifest. When they will manifest. No more struggling. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, you are It is your turn to manifest. And that is my prayer for you this year. This year. This year. You will enter that level. You will enter that level. You will enter that level. I went to preach in a big church. Where there are very rich, rich men. And I said to them. If you can count your money. If you know how much you have. You are still poor. They started laughing. If you can count your money. When you enter the level of manifestation. You will not know how many cows you have. You cannot. I'm telling you. Let us speak the language of money. You cannot. You cannot understand. When you, when you grace and rumor in your life, that is the level I am praying for anybody who comes here for prayer. I am not interested in what you have now. I'm interested in that level where grace has taken over your life. Where grace has taken over your career. Where grace has taken over your business. Where grace has taken over your, your occupation. And you begin to excel. Exceedingly excelling. Excelling and excelling. That is manifestation. Manifestation. 
Oh, you better call me. I say, we will come back here. Oh, because he, oh, be that. Even you are going to be more. Praise the Lord. You hear who you mean? Oh, just oh, one day also. When I listen, oh, I want to show you what manifestation means. Oh, just the oh, see. Hey, where did you get water from? For the matter of your mean, oh, oh, you are busy. Hey, man, oh, just wait. For the matter of your mean, oh, you are busy. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. For the matter before I marry. Where Jimmy way? That's Bucky Gate. Bucky the Gate. Bucky the Gate. Oh, we him. Bucky the Gate. Oh, Bucky the Gate. You have not manifested. <laughs> so you can see the stages of life. That is why today you see they find God. Even when you don't work as a professor, lecturer, get money, you see they find God. If you reach that level, you go use your hand, retire at fifty. Oh God. Me, I will retire at 60. Yes. I will tender my letter of resignation by 60. Then I will carry my load and come and live where I will now stay and do the work of God again without any law. You see some people when they have reached the age of retirement They refuse to retire Because they feel if they retire They go away You have to retire When you retire Because you have reached The level of manifestation You will, you, you, you will not beg You will not lack you will still be performing as if you are still on duty. People will see. That is why if you see who onye mema, somebody who is good, who retire, his house is still busy. Anybody that manifested, that made impact in people's life, even in retirement, his compound is still busy. People still come around. But when you meet somebody who did not manifest or retire even as governor or deputy governor he was joy you will say this guy was a governor before this one was a senator before look at government chairman before honorable before because when he was there as honorable Look at government chairman, deputy governor, governor, senator. He never made impact. Let us, I'm not, I'm talking ordinary now. I'm talking about holiness. Take somebody like Obasanjo. Is Obasanjo tired? Is he tired? Eh? Is he retired? But are you aware that there are some presidents that cannot even talk again? But they are existing. After they came down from office, they never made impact again. They were just there. They, they were just the only name nine they get. Even the name not get power again. But see someone like Obama Sanjo? That guy. That guy. Now Baba. That guy, nah, Baba, he, he get what he get with me. I don't understand. See, not being come here, God open our this for us. The honor, whether they give him as president, governor still give him, but he don't come out. He don't come out to over eight years, over eight years plus. There are some things you see. You say, what, 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 what? Grace. It is great. Our cannot be operating if the grace of God is not with him. Let us believe that God is the one doing it. The glory must go to God. That is what I know. Whether he has special doctor or not, the glory must go to God. We still have many presidents who have led Nigeria, who are still existing. We just buried one recently. Shehu Shagari. Abi? Uh-huh. Many children never heard of him again. But Obasanjo, he's still tearing ground. 
Maybe the wisdom he has. So I pray for you. There are some mothers, eh? The moment their children passes the stage of free stage and enter struggling stage, they no longer enjoy their children again till they die. God forbid. God forbid. No. The moment your child is no longer under your control, free stage, the child begins to struggle. You have lost your child. That is wrong. Do you know why? It will stop you from manifesting. You yourself cannot manifest. You need your children to manifest. So if the devil wants to deal with you, he will attack you when you, when you are ignorant of this kind of message. Let me tell you the truth. Majority of the problems we are having, get not your own okori. Listen to me. The moment you see children who are misbehaving, their mother and their father, they are responsible. Parents, never you blame this child. You see this boy moving now. See this boy coming now. Hey boy, come, come. Push him, come, come. You see this boy now? Come, 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 come. Come, come, come. Come. This boy is nothing but empty bucket. It is what you pour into him that he will carry. All these bad boys, bad girls, you are seeing now. Trace it to their parents. I'm, I've, I'm, this is spiritual reason now. If you are the father of this boy, never you look down on this bucket and say that this bucket cannot carry anything. Why did you go outside? Why did you go outside? You are jumping up and down. Now! Go and sit down. Move. Go and sit down. Give him a seat. Oh yeah, sit down. Sit down there. Go down, sit down. Sit down there. Sit. 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 And I'm telling you, when I see you jump here again, did you hear me? Did you hear me? You are doing like this. I want to hear your voice. Did you hear me? Did you hear me? Huh? Yes. Now, I have poured something into the bucket. Don't wait until this boy has grown to be like this one. Before you start controlling him. <laughs> You know that you have lost it. You've lost it. You've lost it. Many of you have lost your children. And that is why you are not manifesting. I'm telling you, you have lost your son. Sending them to school is not the ultimate. Earlier with training. Education is not training. I know what I'm dealing with my children in my own school. I see what I suffer, of which, if not for God, I was telling them, telling my principals, and they say, You boys should not be angry. You see, these children, in other schools where they, they open school to make money, the, 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 the head of the school not care whether there are hostel masters or not. They're not care. Is it here that we are telling them, fold your hand like this, do like this, say the Lord, and the, 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 the. we are killing ourselves because we are working with conscience. If you know what my students are, the, the, the troubles we are passing through, you won't believe. I now saw that, hey, children are no longer being trained. 
we are educating them so some of these troubles you are seeing now how many of you parents know when your daughter was this virgin Do you know that your daughter that is in school travels to Abuja? And you are here swearing my daughters are holy. Kigi is somewhere. When they were young, the things you poured into the bucket is what they are carrying now. And it is difficult to um, offload it. Kai! Very difficult. To of, that is why I pity parents who teach their children to lie. When your child understands the trick of deceiving the father, deceiving the mother, deceiving the landlord, deceiving the landlady, oh, you are pouring poison into the bucket. I am not comfortable when a mother cannot control the child again. I have suffered that I told you. I had people's children in my house and I thought I was doing good by controlling them, by flogging them, by beating them. I never knew I inquired enemies. Can't you see the one of yesterday here? Frowning. Maybe the mother scolded him. How come father give you something? You didn't tell me. One, one, one. And father said you did not pay your school fees. I'm not accusing you that you ate your school fees. No. I am not angry that you ate your school fees or you don't want to pay your school fees. No. I am angry because you have not paid your school fees and you are holding some of the money for three, four days. Which you are supposed to have paid. Now, the money, school fees is not enough again because you took money from it to pay departmental this. The, is that what they actually can pay? Have you entered the department where you pay? Oh. Now the boy now is now my enemy. Can't you see how I got enemy? I've decided to manifest. The Bible says, if your right hand causes you not to manifest. Aha. That sin there, no me. If your right hand causes you not to manifest. Cut it off. Cut it off. Whipwa. Anything that will stop you. It's like you own your light in your room and then there is something blocking the light from shining. You will carry that thing away. Or you carry your light away. I want to manifest. So we say, I am moving higher this year. Please stop thinking of ordinary moving. Ordinary movement. This is the one I'm talking about. To the level, grace. When you are learning, the grace of God is at work. People will say it that bah, the grace of work. The grace. That is manifestation. People will say bah, why do I say so? When you come to the level of the grace, enemies cannot pull you down again. When you come to the level of manifestation. Cry. You see, you, you know that that's what they call divine security. But when you, money, you, you, are, you live, live at the level of actualization, they can knock you down. And actualization brings about satisfaction. But when you are manifesting, you are never satisfied. You see the hunger to do more. You start praying for opportunities to do more. Amen and amen. So that is my prayer for you. Don't forget, I will leave you now to do private prayers. By 12 o'clock after the angels, we do the other mass for you to manifest. Let me tell you, you can never manifest because the veil is covering you. Devil must go. Darkness must go. Amen. Or Chichi must go for you to shine. You need lights. You need lights for people to see your quality. 
That man is saying he will not marry you because the man has not seen who you are. Let them see who you are. You need light. So, do your private prayer. 12 o'clock, Angelus, I will do the second mass. After that, another message again. And then, we'll do the last mass. Ayalama. In private school, I trained this my child in Madonna. I trained this my child in Covenant. And from there, went to London. In the best school in London. But see what my child is doing. You know, sometimes you see parents, they will say, Father Yao or they, 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 they think I'm stupid though. I don't like people telling me Yao honey. How can you say I don't want her? I know what you are saying now. That because the child went to a very good school, he's supposed to behave well. I, I know now. But I'm telling you that the training he got is half baked training. The education opportunity, great. But the training, error. trained ah, is different from being educated though. we have educated foolish people <laughs> educated proud people educated illiterate they have certificates they lack manners imagine you bringing a young girl to your mother saying mom this is the girl I want to marry and the girl, you, you get you met in half 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 university or UK. You came home and said, Mom, this is the girl, her name is Jane. Then the Jane will not tell her mom, hi babe. Hi, babe. They call your mama, hi babe. <laughs> there is one worker I have who likes calling your young girls, babe, 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 babe. And he's married. And the young girls are happy. I said, you, you are foolish people. You are very foolish. How dare you, a married man is calling you babe. Do you know what is happening? You think I'm jealous? Will I marry you? But I'm seeing something you are not seeing. That man is blocked, covering you, covering your manifestation. They look at me and say, eh? So what do you mean? I told one of them, I said, let me tell you. This one is a very, somebody who has been with me for over 15 years old. I told her, are you stupid? How dare this guy call you babe? Do you know that all those who are around, maybe they hear you, hello, hello, babe. Help. They ask who? He said, no, nah, this person call. They will interpret it to mean. Now I'm saying, with this guy get uh, suppose my babe means my woman. Simple. I say, hey, that's what my mommy used to call me. Your mommy is right to call you babe. Your family members are free to call you baby. But nobody's husband should call you baby. And I ask a young man, what do you call your wife? He said, baby. It's one of the wives. I like what you said. I like, unlike you. You, you, you said? It's one of his wives. Yes. Thank you. If you call your wife, my baby, and you call Okodie, baby, you call Adankwa, baby, that is no, no, no reservation again. Baby is, is so no, that you are a coward. Then those babies that are answering baby that are very happy. When you call them baby, they, say, <laughs> they don't know that their star is being covered. Because no matured boy will hear that you answer baby before a young boy will respect you. If you like, interpret it. For me, no interpretation. Nobody has right to call you baby. Come, come. Hey, not you, mama. This one. Come on. Come, come. Baby. I'm sorry. Baby. My babe. Baby. Babe. Babe. Babe, have fun. Babe. I don't know. I Babe. You like that name, Abby? Tell me the truth. Just talk. Say you like that name, babe. Has anybody called you babe before? Talk to you. Huh? They don't call you babe. What do they call you? Adankwa. <laughs> Go. Please be careful. Out there. Out there. 
Nobody is qualified to call you some names. Because somebody who may want to marry you will be near there. When you call you my babe. Ah, and you will want to respect that person. He will never approach you again. They are blocking your door. My name is Joy. Call me Joy. If you're not church, sister Joy. Okay, well, babe. Babe. And then when you call such guys, say, why? No, father, nothing, no. Nothing, nothing, nothing there between us. Iberiberism. Uh, what is between you is more than what you are saying. It's better for this man to be sexing you than to be giving you that evil vein. How dare you say there's nothing between you? There is. Publicly calling you babe. And you are saying nothing is between two of you. And you answer the babe. And then what do you mean by nothing is between us? No. <laughs> I know, Father, I think you are thinking that maybe he's making love with me. No, nothing is between us. Man, no, DK now, free for now. No, you I can say, Mom, this thing where you didn't answer, it didn't block your blessing. Because this boy, they call you babe anywhere, anyhow, anytime. You feel call him for phone. He answer, he's okay, babe, okay, babe, okay, babe. Those around there will say, Who call you? He said, Now, Joy. Ah, Joy, now your babe. The boy, if he both say no, I want to, no, not no, no, no. Who go believe? Even me, I don't believe. Even all those when I, I interrogated, but not you know, me, I don't see believe. I see the man you said that they sex. I heard you go flog me. Oh. Uh -huh. So stand on your feet. Am I manifesting? Why? With all that God has put in me. I am not manifesting. My children must manifest. I must manifest. I need to shine. I need to excel. Lift up your hands. Whatever that is stopping you from manifesting, the Holy Ghost. Yes, yes, yes. Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. Whatever. That is stopping you from manifesting whatever the Bible says the whole world people are waiting to see Father Dibia manifest, people are waiting to see us manifest. Ah, we must manifest every power stopping us from manifesting. Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost. Every power, every power, every power, every power, other than me, other than you, stopping you from manifesting, I come against them in the name of Jesus. I destroy them in the name of Jesus. Whatever that is stopping this ministry, that is affecting our ministry, whether in the spiritual realm or in the physical realm, for manifesting, for winning souls in abundance, I come against you. I come against you in the name of Jesus. I come against you in the name of Jesus. I come against you in the name of Jesus. Lift up your right hand. Masorobakasha. Ye can de musara machindo. Ye kerebasusu machinkaba. Makuru masina. In the name of Jesus. Take over, Lord. Take over, O Holy Spirit. Take over, Spirit of the Father. Take over, ancient of days. Take over. I want to manifest. I want to move higher. Now lift up your hands as I declare this upon you. Make sure you receive it with a very loud amen. Make sure you receive it. After this, we do our love offering and we go. I'm doing a private prayer. Make sure you receive it with a loud amen. You shall not lack any good thing that we make you manifest. You shall not lack again from today anything that we make you manifest. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus.
one of the things that will make you manifest is rest. Somebody say rest. rest. You need it. You shall not lack rest. Yeah. I say you shall not lack rest. Yeah. You shall not lack rest. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. Number two. What is it that will make you manifest? Refreshment. You know, refreshment. You are refreshed. He make 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 He did refresh. He did refresh. He did empty. You shall not lack refreshment. You shall not lack refreshment. Number three, restoration. You will never lack restoration. You will never lack restoration. Number four, guidance. Guidance. Hey, you cannot. You cannot. You see. You see. Jesus Christ enjoyed it. When the star appeared, the star guided the three men. There are people here, the reason why you are not manifest is that nothing is guiding your destiny helpers. By the power of the most high God, Jesus Christ himself, I declare, you shall not lack guidance. Let me tell you, when you are living without counselors, when you are living without a prophet, when you are living without an advisor, sorry for you who is your prophet you must have a prophet i must not be the one but you must have somebody that instructs you somebody who speaks into you somebody you ask question you ask even before you marry you say should i marry should i go should i stay you need a prophet you need guidance you will not lack guidance you will not lack guidance you will not lack guidance for you to manifest you need protection lift up your two hands protection protection by the power on this altar i declare upon you you will not lack protection you will not lack protection next comfort you need comfort say comfort my people comfort them tell them there is hope you will never lack comfort. The Holy Spirit will comfort you. The angels of God will comfort you. The next one is anointing. If you want to be manifest, you need anointing. 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 Anointing flow over me. Cover me. Give me the power to do oh lord thy prayer anointing flow over me hey give me the power to do your will oh lord thy prayer Receive your anointing in Jesus' name. Yeah. And the last, the last, this last one may surprise you. For you to manifest, if you don't get this one, sorry, for you to manifest, you need joy. Somebody say joy. joy. Say joy. joy. Say joy. joy. Say joy. joy. Lift up your hands. Let joy flow like a river. Yeah. Let joy flow like a river. Yeah. Let joy flow like a river. Yeah. For you to manifest, you need to be happy. Be happy that you are in your husband's house. Never you allow happiness to die. Oh, when happiness dies, you cannot manifest. If I'm no longer happy with father work, I become mechanical. When you become mechanical, it is not good. When you become mechanical, you need to be there, spirit, soul, body, mind, hour, energy, emotion. Oh, you need to be happy. Happy in what you are doing, deriving joy. There is this joy in you. Not because of externality, but you are fulfilled in you. May God give you that happiness. May you enjoy that joy. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty 